It's wonderful that we live in America. We believe in that First Amendment, isn't it? Brewer, escucha, estamos en la lucha. Governor Jan Brewer was here on the Northern Arizona University campus today in support of the opening of the Lumberjack Math Center. Along with her many supporters came a few protesters who are against SB 1070 and her foundings in education. As a state, we are making strides in preparing students to succeed in all areas of higher education. Governor Brewer was just beginning her speech when the protests erupted. I think SB 1070 is an absolutely racist piece of legislation that's uh, targeting Latino and immigrant um, and undocumented populations in uh, Arizona. It's uh, a very violent, um, destructive law that breaks up, has been breaking up families and loved ones from each other. Today's protesters were here about 1070 and to speak out against Brewer's platform on education. Well, um, I think it's ridiculous that the governor's here today cutting a ribbon when she's cut so much funding. I guess maybe that's what she's thinking about, but I think it's really too bad because school is one of the reasons why I came to Arizona in the first place. The fact that she can come here and cut a ribbon doesn't mean she supports education. Until she puts her pen to where uh, down and it supports education through policy, I won't buy it. Protests continued outside, but Brewer stayed focused on higher education here in Northern Arizona. I have been the education governor, I believe. I stake my career on education. I firmly believe Arizona's future is linked to the success of our universities. We must make sure our students have the knowledge and the skills needed to succeed in the economy of tomorrow. After her speech and a brief tour of the new Lumberjack Math Center, Brewer talked with us about SB 1070. We know that um, we want our border secure because we are the gateway uh, for illegal immigration and with that comes a lot of crime and expense to our taxpayers. Many Arizonans are upset with the recent implementation of Senate Bill 1070, which they say allows for racial profiling. But, um, no one's civil rights would be violated and that all law enforcement has been trained. They had been trained previously and um, I think it is uh, just doing the job that we should have been doing and that we had been doing uh, in the past. We're a nation of laws. Most citizens, I would hope, uh, believed in the, believe in the rule of law, and uh, that just needs to be enforced. And Senate Bill 1070 does nothing more than what is already in federal law. For NAZ Today with videographer James Maxey, I'm Haley Leeming.